ask the clerk to make an opening statement and open it up for questions. Um, well, you know, I, I just, I'm, I'm really proud of my team. I think that we had a, a really difficult year. Um, you know, and I think that uh, despite um, key injuries and two captains um, really late in the season, I think that our team never lost our focus, um, never gave up on our goals. And I think that um, that's a true testament to the commitment to everything that we have done all year long um, and to our confidence um, in how balanced this team is. You know, I think that um, ultimately, um, it's a game of possession, and I think that um, we had to earn our possession through defensive stops today. And I think that our defense did a great job of creating those opportunities for our offense, but unfortunately we couldn't win the ball and the draw. Um, and um, we also um, were beaten in ground balls today. Any questions? Monica, can you talk a little bit about um, Mary Teeters? She's got to be one of the tougher goalies you face. I thought she came up kind of big at the end of this game. Um, yeah, we always talk about uh, Mary Teeters and how she's a great goalie, and we always have respect for her. Um, our goal was to shoot uh, low, mid, nonstick today. I think we did a great job. And, I mean, the couple shots at the end were just unlucky. And, I mean, from our Hofstra game, we really focused on shooting low because we were shooting high and getting blocked by the Hofstra goalie. So I think our attack did a great job changing that focus today. Talk about your, uh, what, was, what you were trying to do there at the end to try to set up uh, something and get that tying goal. Were you trying to hold for the last shot or just they were up to the <laughs> so you were able to? to get a good look? Um, well, we were trying to get a goal, and then they got a yellow card, so then we went into our um, man-up offense, and I just think things things didn't really fall apart, but people just like didn't realize they were open, and we just got a last shot that we probably could have gotten a better one, but it was a it was a shot to shot, and it was a low, so I mean. Was there kind of a rush when Mary was over and out of the goal that one time, and the ball, I don't know who had the ball, but it was thrown in the middle, and, and nobody caught it, and that kind of seemed to unsettle you a little bit after that. Remember that part? I actually have. Okay. What, in the last part? Like uh, do you remember that, Shelly? Yes. You, you, you got a little unsettled after that? You didn't make that connection? Go for that quick goal and then. Um, yeah, I, I think that, um, you know, um, unfortunately, because, you know, we weren't doing a great job of attacking in our man up offense um, in that particular set, um, you know, we put ourselves in position to try to thread the needle. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, we needed our offense to be a little bit more aggressive. We, need, we were getting the ball around, but nobody was really looking to get a shot. Nobody was really looking to um, have a penetration pass inside. And there were wide open people, but unfortunately, we were looking to move the ball around the outside instead of really attacking the cage. Um, and I think because of that, um, we put ourselves in a position where we had to score in the last 10 seconds. And with Mary coming out of the cage, I think it you know, created an, um, a, a little bit of frantic um, play amongst our offensive unit. Um, but, you know, um, um, I mean, that's the way the game goes. You know, we hesitated in, in a moment where we had the ball, and, um, you know, that's why Towson's the champion today.